fighting between the Congolese army and the M23 rebels has been raging in the eastern province of North Kivu since last year. The fighting has forced tens of thousands of people to flee their homes. That has raised concerns about the preparations for elections scheduled for December this year. DRC President Felix Chisekedi has warned that the conflict may disrupt the polls. Some Congolese citizens are now calling for the exercise to be suspended. It is not a good decision. The war is still going on in the east. I think they should stop the registration of voters until the situation is stable. The country's electoral commission began the process of registering voters in the troubled province of North Kivu on February 17th, but it has not been possible to do so in the territories under the control of the M23 rebels. The DRC president accused the Rwandan government of supporting the M23 rebels, a charge Rwanda has repeatedly denied. President Chisekedi also appealed to the international community to help his country restore peace in the eastern part of the country. The armed conflict has destroyed the livelihood of thousands of Congolese citizens. Congolese people, particularly those in North Kivu province, want to see peace return to their area more than anything else. Some political analysts fear the violence may lead to the postponement of elections. The M23 rebel group is largely composed of ethnic Tutsis who accuse the DRC government of marginalizing them and failing to honor a peace deal signed in 2013. The rebels have continued capturing territories despite a call for a ceasefire by leaders from the East African community. The regional leaders recently ordered the M23 rebels to leave all the occupied areas by March 30th. Chris Sochamringa, CGTN, Kinshasa, Democratic Republic of Congo.